Hey everyone, it's Bonnie. Happy Wednesday! I'm doing an impromptu live in the middle of a very bad storm. Uh, yay! Hey, Yvonne. Um, so there's a likelihood that the power could go out. <laughs> So we shall see. Um, I probably shouldn't be doing a live right now, <clears throat> but I was going to do a video and I'm like, you know what? I'm just going to do it as a live. So I'm kind of looking at the radar right now and it looks like, yeah, like there's this giant green thing moving through. So that's what's making me a little nervous. I think it's actually past us. It looks like it's moving into Pennsylvania now, but for some odd reason, um, we're under a tornado watch until midnight. So I don't know if there's more. Um, oh, hey, uh, I can't I can't read from here. Uh, Gwendy, yay! Um, I was just telling everyone. Uh, oh, a sinful sense, yay! Hey, April. Hey, Vanessa. Hey, Brayden. Hey, Michelle. Casey. Courtney. Brandy Loves Candles, Chocolate Chip Banana Pancakes, Teresa, Britt. We got a lot of people here. <laughs> I was just talking about, like, I don't know if I should be doing a live right now because um, we're in the middle of a tornado watch right here. And look at the radar. It is terrible out. So stay safe out there. Hey, Laura. Hey, Susie. Um, so if I suddenly disappear... It means the power went out. I don't, I think we're past now. Hey, Brianna. Hey, Dan. Um, but you never know. I don't know what the weather's doing. I was actually, I have a window that's like right here. Hey, Heather. Um, and literally there was a straight down bolt of lightning, like right over the lake. And it really scared me. I'm like, oh my gosh, move away from the window. <laughs> so, um, oh yeah, you guys, Florida's moving into hurricane season. I know. Uh, it was like, 79 degrees here. I gotta say, it was like warm today. Um, and then probably about like five or six is when the storm started moving in. Check out what I'm drinking tonight, you guys. My husband got me that um bottled Coca-Cola Fanta mix. Um, uh, this stuff is awesome. I have a little party here with orange soda. Uh, let's see. Uh, yes. Yeah, yeah, I know. Don't go outside, you guys. Stay inside. Check out the live. I actually have a fun one. Um, I mean, oh, Buffalo. Yes, Buffalo. It's heading your way, Vanessa. I think it's going that way. Um, I was laughing. I was going to do a video and I'm like, you know what? Yeah, it has real sugar, Laura. It does. I know. It's got real. It's got it's got cane sugar in it. <laughs> you know me and my sugar. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> Uh, oh, George is having bad weather tonight, too. That's, stay safe, Heather. I know. I feel like I always, I'm like a, you know me, I'm like such a weather nerd. Um, and I, I'm always going on looking at the weather. Oh, my gosh, over in Dubai. I cannot believe how bad. Oh, hey, Joanne. Um, oh, hey, Megan. Leslie, hey. It just like, I could not believe how bad it was over there. If anyone saw the storms in Dubai roll through, I'm like, oh, my gosh. Like, trees are being uprooted. Um, oh, hey, Jennifer. Oh, hey, Chris. We're talking about the weather right now. Are you, you getting any rain in Columbus, Chris? I just got a huge snowstorm. Snowstorm. I can't believe. <laughs> Rainstorm. Oh, my gosh. I, I need more sugar. Clearly. I don't know if you're getting it, Chris. Um, I was just on the radar. I don't think Columbus is getting it, actually. Oh, maybe Zanesville. Uh, I think it just went through you guys, Chris. I think you're through. So, I was a little worried. Um, yeah, a lot of rain. Oh, good. It's sunny there now. Yay! <clears throat> yeah, it's starting to get a little bit better here now, but what a crazy... E oh, Dirty Cell Sub Company's here! Yay! Yeah. Oh my gosh, you're in Arizona. I, you guys need the rain. I know. Um, hey, everyone. So, I was going to do a video, and then I'm like, you know what? Look what I found! <laughs> I'm doing a use it or lose it video. We're going to go through this random bit of stuff and figure out if I should use it or lose it. Uh, Barbara, I had a question. Does anybody else, a uh, dog gets sick when you light a candle? You know what? I haven't had that. And actually, Coco's never been bothered by the candles. Uh, oh, hey, Kara. Uh, Cor 
Courtney. Hey. Oh my gosh, we got the whole gang here tonight. We need where's Angel? Angel. Um Yvonne. Uh so I'm <laughs> so I'm doing it. Uh, I'll lose it or use it. Check this out. I need a whole bunch of these. I could actually juggle. This is a very old, I think this is old. I got to look at the expiration date or the barcode on here. I can't even see it. Um, I don't know when this was manufactured. I just did that whole video this morning. Uh, yes, it's like, well, it's supposed to get really cold now. <coughs> I'm hoping I'm not coughing either. I got my, I got my fan of soda here if I cough. Um, let's see. Um, this is a gingham bath fizzy. So you guys know me. I prefer the lush fizzies. By the way, I got the entire, um, not the entire thing, but I got a lot of the Shrek collection coming tomorrow. I'm going to do a video on that. Um, I don't like the Bath and Body Works version. These are kind of like Alka-Seltzer. So you put one of these in the water and it just like fizzes off instantly. They, they have a nice scent, but they, they're like oily. I like a good lush bath bomb. They, they're like art. Uh, I went to lunch. Oh, did you really, Chris? Yay. I'm so excited. I can't wait to get the Shrek bath bomb. It's supposed to be like bathing in a swamp. I'm like, bring it on. <laughs> uh, as far, Courtney, as far as bath bombs, um, Lush is, Lush is like, Bath and Body Works is here. Lush is like up here. Unfortunately, I mean, they're not like a horrible product, but Lush just is amazing when it comes to the bath bombs. Um, let's see. Um, I'm trying, I'm trying to read and do this at the same time. Yes. Uh, more Lux bath in the collection. That would be good. Okay. So like I said, I found all this stuff and I'm like, I need to use this up. I got a summer melody, uh, exfoliating glow body scrub. This is going right in the shower. This is actually a nice formula. The exfoliating glow. I know a lot of people want summer melody back. This is the golden honeydew and bronze vanilla. This was a good find. I was excited. I found that. So that's a yay. Um, I actually have a couple of moisturizing body washes that I want to use it up. Butterfly and uh, sweet kiwi and star fruit. Both scents I actually really like. Um, so I have one of those like shower racks. I definitely um, want to use these. Oh, Joanne. Dirty Cell Soap, received my first order, absolutely love every scent, banana cream pie, glazed blueberry donut, oh, that's exciting, uh, let's see, um, ah, Queen of the Nile, you remind me of Gail King, oh, that's so, what a, thank you, that's a great compliment, I love her, uh, let's see. Oh, all these new people are coming in. I need Angel to, to tell me who's coming in. Um, Teresa's here, Heather. Um, so yeah, I'm going to use these up. I'm, you know, before summer, I want to use those up. Uh, let's see, Bonnie, do you have any predictions for what will be at SAS? You know what? I don't, I really don't. I was hoping that they would bring back like summer. Mel oh, hey, Philly. Um, I was hoping they would bring back Summer Melody because a lot of people want it. Magnolia Charm would be a good one. Um, some of the retro scents, that would be great. Uh, let's see here. Uh, roasted Sesame Candle. Oh, smells like pumpkin pecan brittle. Has anyone seen those um, Asian American? Uh, I haven't seen them. I'm uh, Asia. It's the Asian Pacific Heritage Month. I have not seen any of those candles yet. Uh, just another face in the crowd. Bonnie, we need an eyeglasses collection. Oh my gosh, I know. I've been wearing these clear ones. I'm ready to swap glasses. I really am. I got my glasses around here somewhere. I swear, even if I had LASIK, I would still wear glasses. I love my glasses. Um, oh, cu cucumber melon. <laughs> Dang, <Dengel> soft company. <laughs> you guys know how I feel about cucumber melon. Although I really am enjoying the blueberry raspberry snow cone. You guys need to get this one. Seriously. This is amazing for summer. Dirty Soul Soap Company. Um, our store receives them today. Oh, how great. That's really great. I'm excited. I got to stop in the store. Um, I was wondering about the roasted sesame, too. I know. I'm drinking fan too much sugar. I know. I'm drinking too much sugar tonight. Uh, oh, hey, uh, Belkin. It's storming here. We got a storm. Okay. Look what else I got in here. I have two of the shapeable soaps. These are fun, but they don't serve a lot of 
purpose. So, oh my God, I need Lenny here. I love spraying these because he just goes crazy for this stuff. Uh, these are the ones that are like the little like puff balls. Um, they don't really work, but they're fun. That is Among the Clouds. And then I have another one. These are going to be, I don't know, I think I'm just going to put, I don't know what I'm going to do with these. Oh, there we go. See, they're fun, you guys. They're, they're just, one time I had an extra one and I literally sprayed out the whole can. I had people yelling at me because they're like, don't waste it. I'm like, I'm not really wasting it. I'm just, this is science. It's like a $5 science experiment. Um, and what I did was I, I, it was like this big. It was huge. It was so funny. But these are fun, but they don't really serve like a bathing purpose. They don't like do much. Oh, hey, Valerie. Val Valeria. I love your name, by the way. That's a that's a pretty name. Um, so I know like <laughs> they're so much fun. I like I literally I just like therapy. You could just sit here and play with these when you're like stressed out. <laughs> oh, Moonlit Path. My mother's all-time favorite scent. Seriously, like my mother loves Moonlit Path. It's actually a 10 scent. Um, if you like the um that type of scent. So okay, I gotta I'm gonna combine my stuff here and I gotta I guess I you know I have a garbage can over here I, I I should set this somewhere so it doesn't like disintegrate okay so you know what I'm gonna do with these I have another bin that's like my review bin I hate to get rid of these because what's gonna happen is I like to demo these out so I'm gonna like I'm not gonna use them up but I'm gonna keep them so that's what I'm gonna do with those okay use it or lose it I have the glowing fruit enzyme collection so gotta say I don't love this. It's not terrible. I used it a couple times. So you know what? My mother-in-law loves fruity scents. So I'm going to give this to her and see what she thinks. I think she might like it. It's a bright citrusy scent. So this is going to be a lose it. I'm going to give this one off. I decided to pass on that one. Um, oh, hey, Lori. Uh, you know, it's not like, I don't feel like it's a, it's like a game changer on my skin. It doesn't really do much. I wasn't super impressed. I actually, the two in the collection that I like the most are the oatmeal and the, um, the water. I don't even like the cocoa shade much anymore because I don't think it smells like the original. Um, let's see. What else is in here? Oh, uh, I have Calm Haven Iris and Lavender uh, Whip Body Butter. I'm going to use this up. This actually smells really good. Oh, we were talking about, remember we were talking about this morning? I did the whole video on expiration dates. Check out how this is kind of turning an odd brown color. So this was manufactured. Let me look at the little date. Where can I? Oh, sometimes you can't. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding? They use beige on beige. Um, I can't even see the date. I think this was 2023. Um, Oh, Angel's here. I, hey, Courtney. I was just talking about you, Angel. I'm like, I need you to be like, <laughs> ah, people coming in. <laughs> We're talking about the weather. I got my orange Fanta soda here um, that probably exists somewhere in the Harry Potter world. Oh, hey, nurse. Um, hey, Courtney. Um, so anyway, this one is a little discolored. However... I did notice that um, it's fine. It's actually fine. So that's a use it. And it smells really good. It's really relaxing. I'm like, this is this is super chill. Um, oh, the rain is, uh, yeah. I think the rain has finally moved out. It's funny. I got my phone here because we're under a tornado watch. And I'm like, this big green thing like just moved through. But I think it's past our area now. I don't know if it's going to pick up later. Um, it looks like Chris is safe. It's going into like Zanesville now. So if you're down in Zanesville, be careful. Um, okay. What else do I got in here? Uh, Tutti Fruity Candy. I'm going to do a use it up on this one. I'm going to use this both as a body cream and as a furniture polish. This actually smells really good to me. It's all sugary. Oh, hey, Le hi, Leslie. Um, so this is definitely a use it up. Okay. Use it or lose it. Um, oh, this is a loser. I've got the Jasmine Eucalyptus Sea Soul Refreshing. I didn't like this one at all. This is a loser. Did anyone like this one? I don't even know if anyone remembers this one. This was from a while ago. What's the date on here? Uh, 2023. It was like a year ago. This was came out. I don't, what does this even smell like? I don't even remember, you guys. 
I didn't think I liked it. Though. Oh, yuck. Oh, okay. Um, It's like all like weirdly separated. Okay, I think I can shake it up. No, this is a total no. Jasmine Eucalyptus. I think I could shake it up. It's it's really kind of odd. It kind of separated. I wonder if that one just went bad. Okay, we're going to set that aside. That's definitely a lose it. Oh, hey, Karen. Um, lose it. Yeah. Boom. <laughs> we're just going to vote. <laughs> Thumbs down. <laughs> uh, get your mom. Uh, yeah, I know. I know. My mom, you know what my mom's doing? She's watching the weather. <laughs> My mother, I think she talked to her sister and watching the weather. They like to compare weather. They're only like 10 miles apart, but they're like, what's it doing over there? Uh, hey, KMC. Uh, oh, by the way, is anyone anyone else's allergies bothering them? My eyes are just running from all of the trees. So I got over my cough and now I got the problem with the trees. Okay. Oh, here's, a, here's one. The Coco Shea body oil. I actually like this. I was just saying I didn't like the Coco Shea. The body oil is not that bad. You can use this like right after you shave and it's actually not bad. It doesn't um, uh, feel oily after you rub it in. So I actually really, oh, Chris, you like this stuff too? Yay. Thumbs up. Yay. Are we gonna, what are we going to get? Are we going to get, we got fireworks. Yay. When are you doing a YouTube with your daughter? You know, my daughter does not like doing YouTube with me. That's just not her thing. Uh, I might be able to get my mom on. Uh, my husband and my daughter are not like YouTube people. They're like, eh, you know, um, Lenny and my mom. We should do like all three of us. That would actually be fun. Um, let's see. Rams. Uh, let's see. Rams. Who else is here? I keep seeing people come in. Okay. Use it or lose it. Himalayan Oasis. This is a lose it. Oh, my gosh. This is the most pungent, awful scent ever. It is, what the heck is in this thing? Uh, vetiver and bergamot. Um, it was so <laughs> pungent. But you know what you can use these for? Oh my gosh, I could not put this on myself. Because, um, no, 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 no. Um, you can use this, believe it or not, to wash uh, the bathtub. Now, I use bleach. I'm a big bleach girl too. But... If you have like, um, like we have one of those, you know, acrylic white newer tubs and this is actually a really good, um, or like on like plastic, um, like, I don't know what it is. It's like tile or whatever. Uh, Bonnie, how old is your daughter? Uh, I wasn't aware that you had a daughter. I do. She's a, she's almost 18. <laughs> I, have a, I have an older child. Yes. I have an older child. Uh, yeah, um, this just does not, I don't know. It, it's good for cleaning the bathtub. It is not good for um, like putting on yourself. I just, I, it's too harsh. These are, these salt body scrubs, I like them on your feet or like elbows and stuff, but they're a little harsh. So that's going to be a, oh my gosh, my, my, my ball is melting here. I'm going to try and toss this. Oh, I just made a mess. Okay, that's okay. Uh, <laughs> I remember. Yes. Oh, Yvonne. Yes, my daughter, my mother and I did do a YouTube uh, Mother's Day video once like four years ago. So if you look that up in my uh, history, you'll find that one. <laughs> uh, Gingham Gorgeous. Okay, what else I got in here? Oh, look, I have a Calypso Clementine uh, Mini. That's a, that's a, use it. I'll definitely keep that one. I have a tropidelic exfoliating body scrub. This is lose it, you guys. Um, I'm putting together a box for my mother-in-law, and um, I'm going to give her a whole bunch of stuff. She usually loves everything, so I think she'll like that. Bonnie, do you like Black Cherry Merlot? Yes, I do like Black Cherry Merlot. Black Cherry Merlot is actually awesome. Uh, tropidelic, I just can't get on board with you guys. Oh! Love always wins. This is the Shimmer Gel Body Lotion it's from two years ago. Oh, this is definitely a use it. Oh my gosh, this is cool. It's like a it's like a gel sparkly thing. Yay! Oh, by the way, thank you so much. Um, a couple of people have been 
purchasing our pride t-shirts on Bon Leo. Thank you. And a couple of like the other products. We always appreciate that. If you want to shop Bon Leo, which is the merch site that Lenny and I are doing, it's B-O-N-L-E-O.com. Use Queen 10 for 10% off. But, um, oh, you're spoiled. No, this, this is actually in really good. Can, I'm like, whoa, it's working. Okay. That's definitely, that's a use it. Um, oh, this is a use it. I didn't even know I had this Tutti Fruity candy in the um, the shower gel. I am putting that in the shower like today. Okay, I need a drink. Um, I didn't know you were a pride person. Ah, uh, yeah, of course. Um, let's see. I went I went to the test store today and still no summer. I know what is going on with the summer. Lori, uh, Bonnie, what is your guess on what you think is going to be discontinued? <sighs> you know what? Um, I don't think they're going to get rid of laundry detergent. I honestly don't. I think it's selling too well. Um, I'm wondering if they're going to retire. Actually, um, is Mug the Cloud still around even? Like some of the older ones, like, like maybe Luminous. You think Luminous is going to stay around? I don't know. Uh, yeah. Sweet Tea and Lemonade, I heard. That's actually good news. Um, look at this. I have Costa Rica. I have uh, pink pineapple sunrise, sunshine guavatini, Bonnie. Oh, my! <laughs> I know this is good. I haven't had this in like a really long time. It tastes amazing. Um, let's see here. I think I have. What other one do I have? Oh, and no. Okay, so I have two of the tropicals. These are definitely going up in the use it bin. I love these two. Um, Fiji sunshine guavatini smells awesome. Yeah, that's good. Uh, Let's see. Uh, oh, hey, Karen. Um, Dream Bright Moisturizing Body Wash. I think I bought this at a um, body care sale. I'm going to lose it, you guys. I don't know. I'm not in my dream, dream Bright right now. I'm just like, this isn't doing anything for me. This is a lose it. Um, let's go to my mother-in-law. Um, let's see. I hope they don't discontinue sprinkled birthday cake. Three wick. Is that even still available, Pamela? I was wondering about that. Do we still have the three wick? I hope we do. That's a good one. They need to bring back black currant and vanilla. I think I have one of those somewhere. That's a good one. Um, let's see here. Uh, buddy, can you recommend a good coconut candle? Oh my gosh. You know what the best coconut candle is for me? Fresh coconut colada. I don't know if they're going to bring it back this year, but that is like the most wonderful coconut candle ever if you can find a fresh coconut colada that is the one i'm trying to think of one in the current collection do i have any coconut candles here i'm not loving anything in the current collection actually uh oh hey donna yay you're coming to ohio yay oh hi aurelia hi donna uh, Donna's the one coming to Ohio. Yay. I'm trying to read this as it's scrolling by. <laughs> Facts of Life is here. Oh, hey, Raymond. Oh, Little Black Dress. Yes, that's a good one to bring back. Absolutely. Waikiki Beach Coconut. Uh, yeah, that's a really good conditioner. I like that. Um, you know what? I'm so bad at empties, Belkin. I gotta say, I just literally, when I have an empty, I usually just toss it. I'm, I'll, I'll try and be good and save my empties. I'm terrible about doing that. It's mostly soap and shower gel, I gotta say. Oh, hey, there's 150 people here. I'm surprised in the storm. Um, What else do I have in here? Oh, I have a peach bellini. <laughs> Yay. Oh, Midsummer Dream. Yeah, that's a good one, lady. Oh, this smells so good. I even like peach and I love this. Oh, this is a use it. We're definitely using this one. That is not a lose it. Um, that smells really good. Okay. We're going to put that over there. I have an at the beach conditioner. So this was the, oh no, Kristen, you're in the basement right now. Oh, wait a minute. Minutes from Cleveland. Wait a minute. Is Cleveland getting more? That's not good. Are we getting more? Uh-oh, that's not good. Um. Yeah, we're supposed to. We need Mark Johnson to tell us what's happening here. Um, yeah, Cle I, I think we're safe right now um, east of Cleveland. Okay, so this was the first shampoo conditioner I used was at the beach. I did not like it 
at all. I was like, gross. I don't know. This just didn't do anything for me. That's a lose it. Lose it, lose it, lose it. Yeah, it's getting a little bit brighter over here. I also have a lavender and vanilla sleep conditioner. I should actually use this. Seriously. Um, this actually smells pretty good. Oh, yay, Donna, flying into Cleveland. Uh, lots of good Bath and Body Works in the Cleveland area. You got to stop at one. Uh, will there be another full-size candle sale this week? Yes, I think, you know what, let me go to Tessa's uh, site here. Let me see here. Tess, uh, life inside the page. Um, I think we're supposed to be having a candle sale. What's today? The 15th? Tomorrow is the lip event. So, um, oh, thank you, Gianni. Um, I'm probably, have I seen your name wrong? I'm terrible with names. I can't read very quick and I can't see. Um, Brandy loves candles. Where are the new candles? It's, it has been a while. Okay. Friday, we're going to have a candle sale. I don't know what the price is going to be. Anyone know what the Friday candle price is going to be on the sale? Oh, Ohio Garden Goddess is here. Yay! Um, Haley's here. Got more people rolling in. My daughter loves hummingbird. Yeah, it's the hummingbird tea cake. That's really good. It's a pineapple. Um, oh, my gosh. I have more Coco Shea. Uh, I'm not crazy about this this time. I don't know why. I don't hate it. I just don't love it. Um, yeah, it's okay. I think I'm going to lose it. I'm going to give this off to my mother-in-law. Um, oh, 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 oh. Look what I have in here. I have an endless sea sea salt hair mist. Bath and Body Works needs to do more of this. I like this formula. So you just kind of mist it on. And then um, it kind of gives you like a really nice like beachy look. So yeah, I'm going to keep this out for I This is a lot left. I'm going to use this unless they bring it back. Uh, I'm definitely going to use that up. Do you think they will have coconut and cotton in candles? That's possible, Brandy. That one I could see coming back. Um, yeah, firecracker pops coming back. That's going to be a good one. I can't wait for summer. Honestly, like, I don't know why I'm like so excited for summer. Oh, hey, Brayden. Um, oh, thank you. Thank you, uh, Rogers. Yeah, my hair is a lot of work because it gets out of control fast. And I gotta say, like, a lot of these products really do kind of tame it down a little. It kind of just, it helps there. I, it, I, I look, I look more, um, here looks tamer. Uh, <laughs> do you know if Moonlit Path will come back in stores? I don't know. I would think it would. A lot of people love that one. Um, what else do I have in here? What else do I have left? Oh, I'm going to gift off my Tropidelic. It's a lose it. I have a couple of those. And then, um, oh, Rainfall Retreat. This was... Um, Let's see. What was this one? Uh, eucalyptus, warm cedarwood, and dewy cucumber. This is actually a nice one. I gotta say, I like the shaving um, gel. It's nice. And um, I don't know. This one smells really good. Oh, Dirty Souls Hope Company is still here. Toya needs to know if you have a dupe for Hibiscus Paradise. Uh, Bonnie, when you wear a ponytail, it's a good look. Oh, thank you. You know what? I wear my ponytail just because a lot of times I don't have time to do my hair in the morning. And um, I like wearing a ponytail. I got to say, it's like, it's like a thing for me. <laughs> Would like to see more shave gels. Oh my gosh. Ohio Garden. Yeah. Um, we totally need more shave gel. I'm going to box this stuff up for my mother-in-law. Um, we definitely need more shave gel. We need shave gel. We need, oh, Toya, we have a dupe. Uh, it's called Tropical Hibiscus. Oh, yay! That's good news. Um, uh, yeah, baby. Yeah, I know. I, I I always thought, like, as I'm getting older, I should, like, do a pink streak or something in my hair. Remember, um, oh, my gosh, the band, it just left my head. Oh, Berlin. Remember Terry Nunn from Berlin used to have the blonde hair and the black on the bottom? I used to think she was so cool. <coughs> that was awesome. Um, thank you for asking. Uh, oh, yeah. Check out your site. Ah, thank you. Um, Carla, I love watching your videos. As a part-time employee at Bath & Body Works, it helps me keep up on stuff with them. Oh, thank you. I always appreciate it when employees um, watch. That's so awesome. 
Um, I never thought of collecting Bath and Body Works till I watched this. Bonnie convinced me, and I love all things Harry Potter. <laughs> oh my god, I know. I'm such a Harry Potter fan. <laughs> oh my gosh. I know. Like Harry Potter. <clears throat> you know what the funny thing is, you guys? Uh oh, thank you, Jennifer. Um, the really funny thing is, I'm 54 years old, so I'm definitely on the old end of Harry Potter. And the interesting thing is, um, Harry Potter was like up and coming, I want to say when I was like in my late twenties. So I was like working, I was not involved with Harry Potter. You know, it, it just wasn't on my radar. I didn't have kids then. And then um, my daughter wasn't in that Harry Potter generation. She was a little bit young. So when I was like 40, I picked up a Harry Potter book for the first time and I read it and I literally, I kid you not. I remember Jason Isaac saying the same thing. Like when he started reading the series, I literally like, just went through the books like crazy. Um, it was kind of funny. <laughs> I did not stop. I was like, I was like, I couldn't even put the books down. And then of course I'm a huge Alan Rickman fan. So uh, the movies were wonderful. So I, yeah, I was late to the Harry Potter game. Uh, what is Bath and Body Works return policy? Oh my gosh. I think you need a receipt. It used to be really easy to return stuff at Bath and Body Works. You could just basically walk in and be like, I don't like this. And they'd give you like a new one of anything you wanted in the cream. Now you have to show your driver's license. Um, it's a little bit more because people are abusing the system. So I'm not exactly even sure. I usually never return stuff. Um, Angel, I didn't know you were late. That's interesting. Oh, wow. We truly are Harry Potter sisters. Um, let's see here. Um, I love everything. My order. Oh God. Dirty Soul. I love it when people love Dirty Soul Soap Company. That is so awesome. Yay. Uh, what is better, Harry Potter or Lord of the Rings? <sighs> you know, that's so tough. You know, I am such a Harry Potter fan because like I said, I'm a huge Alan Rickman fan. Um, Lord of the Rings is quite amazing though. I gotta say. So yes, <laughs> I like them both. Uh, what is a good sugar candle, any brand that you know of? Um, Kringle does a lot of good sugar candles. Goose Creek does an amazing job with sugar. I got to say, um, Harry Slatkin, the grape candle is coming. I got this somewhere over here. Uh, they have the matcha tea. I can't reach it right now. But they have a grape soda candle coming that's going to be amazing. Um, I always forget, what kind of collections are left to expect for summer since we've already had tropical? Okay, so Sarah, that's a really good question. So what's going to happen is Mother's Day tote is coming next. And then after Mother's Day tote, we will start easing into semi-annual sale summer. So that's going to be around the second week of September. September. What did I just say September? crack myself up on the second week of May. So what's going to happen is we're going to have a collision of seasons. That's what I'm thinking September. Things are going to start moving real fast, you guys. We're going to get semi-annual sale, summer, and then we're going to get start like Halloween previews coming in. Oh, I just glitched. Is it the weather? Um, what do you think of champagne toast? I love champagne toast. It's one of those scents that's like, over and over and over they do it, but I really love it. It's a good set. Um, oh, questions are good. I love questions. We need wild. Oh, we do need wild Madagascar vanilla back. Absolutely. Um, let's see. Hi, Tara. Grape soda candle. Yeah, I don't even know when that's going live. I gotta find out about that, but it's a good, I gotta review it. It's great. Um, I recommended a Bath and Body Works. Yeah, if they did a Harry Potter collab, that would be really cool. Uh, let's see. Oh, wait. Doing Harry. Okay, that's cool. Um, let's see here. I'm trying to enjoy spring and summer scents. I agree. Um, that's the problem with Halloween. So I, I totally agree with you, um, Brayden. Like, I like enjoying summer. I really do. Summer is a thing for me. I love summer, but at the same time, my wheels are always turning for Halloween and fall because it's like so much fun. So yeah, I do like to enjoy summer too. Uh, Vanessa, can you give me a few lotions to grab to go on when you're wearing my luxury scents like pink? Um, so you mean mix and match, Vanessa? Yeah, like that's a really good thing. Um, whipped rose latte. 
I think would go really well with um, Rose Parade. Like, or is it, what's it called? It's not Rose Parade. Is it Rose Parade? No, it's Parade of Rose. No, Covered in Roses. I'm like, it's Rose. I'm mixing these up here, guys. Covered in Roses, Whipped Rose Latte. Um, You could do anything with vanilla. The, um, the Viva Vanilla. I've layered a lot of different stuff with those. Um, I would, oops. Oh no, Greg. <laughs> Greg just had an accident. Oh my gosh. Are you okay, Greg? <laughs> Greg's okay. He lost his shoe and his tiki, uh, but he's he's okay for the most part. There you go, Greg. Sorry about that. Um, <clears throat> uh, do you know what day June SAS starts? I am hearing it's going to start early. Maybe the 31st. <laughs> Poor Greg. Greg is so abused. <laughs> he's always falling. <laughs> I always joke around. I'm like, I miss Lenny. <laughs> what kind is Greg? Um, Greg went diving in Hawaii. I can't stop laughing, you guys. Start laughing. I'm going to start coughing. <coughs> I just logged in to find Greg. Oh, my God. Brianna, I am dying. I just logged in to find Greg leap to his death. <laughs> Alice is Alice is in the ether. She's, like, hanging out somewhere out there. Blair is in a drawer somewhere. i got to locate Blair, too. Poor Greg is... Poor Greg lost his girlfriend and his maid. <laughs> That's tragic. Oh, oh my gosh. Uh, oh, hey, Mo. Hi, Megan. Uh, what's my scent of the day? Uh, you know what my scent of the day is? I got to grab it. I just had this on. I had two scents of the day. I have been wearing... Aha! Uh -huh. Check it out. Uh, Bonfire Bash. I'm wearing Bonfire Bash, you guys. And I've been wearing the Dirty Soul Sub Company Vanilla Waffle Cone. And these actually go together really, really well. So those are my sense of the day. Um, let's see. <sighs> Hi, 49. Uh, I don't think <laughs> Alice, I got to, okay. That's on my to-do list. I, to, I got to mark to-do, find Alice. <laughs> I just find the perfect dupe uh, covered in roses. Oh, wow. <clears throat> oh yeah, Dahlia is good. Uh, let's see. Craig's all alone. Uh, honestly, I think I think I know where Blair is. I gotta I gotta find Blair. Um, <laughs> she went back to boarding school. Uh, let's see. Oh, crafting after midnight. You made it. We've been talking about talking about the weather. We've been doing use it or lose it. We've been drinking some Fanta orange soda here. Oh, hey, uh, Maggie and um. We just lost Greg, but he's back. So all is well. Yay! <laughs> Anyone else got any Bath and Body Works questions for me? I will try to answer them as best I can. Um, we're just kind of, all of us are like anticipating summer. I think Life Inside the Page, uh, she just did a post about summer soap. We can go over those. That's actually fun. Uh, summer Archive. Um, ah, uh, yeah, so I hit the like button. Okay, where did my summer archive go? Summer archive, she just had these on. Oh, okay, let me get these on my phone. Um, I can't even read these because they're kind of small. There's an endless kind of summer collection coming. I feel like we're all just like on the seat of our pants, like edge of our seat, pants on fire. <laughs> when is summer coming? <laughs> uh, Mint ice cream soap. Ooh, that sounds good. Do you have any Moonlit Path items currently? I do. Actually, my mom has a whole collection of Moonlit Paths because it's like one of her favorite scents ever. Uh, yeah, weather is not good. Oceanside Lavender is a new scent. Steph, I have not heard of that one. That sounds good. Um, hi, Bonnie. Your video inspired me to go through all my body creams to use. Oh, great idea, Katie. Seriously, that's a great idea. How is bourbon strawberry vanilla? It's good, Lindsay. I gotta say, that's a nice summer scent. Um, I definitely recommend that one. Uh, was there supposed to be a special sale before SAS? I don't know. That's a good question, because Life Inside the Page was talking about, like, a summer sale, but I don't know if she was talking about summer semi-annual or a different sale. So, uh, we're all kind of just waiting on that one. A friend is sending me some myths from the U.S. One of them is Forever Red. Oh, that's a good one. Forever Red is amazing. Um, no, my mother's not liking the new Japanese cherry blossom at all. She likes the original version way better. 
Um, let me see here. Uh, Bonnie, any recommendations for Black Current sent in? Um, oh, Dirty Soul Sub, do you guys have Black Current at all? I, I'd be curious about that if you guys have Black Current. Um, Britt, do they do Memorial Day? I don't, they don't really do anything for Memorial Day, but we should get some. 4th of July home decor. Although has anyone noticed that like the home decor has been like zilch, like nothing. I don't know what's going on. We have not had any water globes since the elephant. I'm thinking there's a supply chain issue going on. I don't know. Something's happening now. It's kind of weird. Uh, my friend just got O Cherry and she really, I love O Cherry. Oh, Sweetheart Cherry. Definitely one of my favorites. Um, Crafting After Midnight. That's a good question. We don't know yet about semi-annual sale coming early yet. It's possible that it may come May 31st. Um, Mary Kate, uh, her stores never got the luxury scents. Um, yeah, Steph, no candle sle sleeves. I know. What's going on with that? Totally weird. Uh, are there going to be any summer gourmands, Latia? I hope. I certainly hope so. We need some sort of summer foodie scent. Um, we, we, we need Bonfire Bash back. There's a lot on my wish list for summer. Um, let's see here. It's not Bath and Body Works, but Olay has a black currant body wash. Oh, that's interesting. Um, oh, gosh. Remember? Was that? Oh, remember Dove? Was it Dove did that whole peppermint bark thing last Christmas? That was kind of bizarre. Um, I think Life Inside the Page mentioned that some of the summer soap is supposed to come April 26th. That's good to know. Um, yeah, I'm going to have to log off soon to you guys. I actually, I got to be off by eight, but, um, I wanted to do, this is fun. I got a good live in tonight. This is actually really fun. Um, I noticed everyday luxuries. Yes. Back in stock online. Um, oh, Hey, Charlene, how you doing? I'll post this, uh, live as a replay too. So if anyone wants to watch it, bring on the bakery. Yay. Uh, yes, I definitely agree with that. Buddy, from your experience, Bath & Body Works, how many times do they do the $5.95 sale? So they've been doing the $5.95, $4.95, $5.95 body care sale like a lot like um, more than they used to. So I would not be surprised if sometime in the middle of May they do another body care sale just to get rid of all of like the tropical and um, these newer collections to get ready for summer. So I think I think it's going to happen. You know what? I was curious if Luminous is maybe going away. I don't know. It could. Um, another one, um, Pure Wonder, they brought that back. It could be going away. We don't know. Um, it's, it's very popular, though. Uh, Key Lime Pie. Oh, yeah. Do they think Boardwalk Vanilla Cone? Um that's possible. That's the can. The board, that was a candle. Oh, that was a soap. Boardwalk vanilla cone. Wasn't that the soap? Everyone wants to know if Berry Waffle Cone's coming back this year. I know a lot of people love Berry Waffle Cone and the body care. Yes, Margarita Cupcake. Yes, we definitely need that one back. Um, Lady Marie, why did Goose Creek stop selling body care? Um, I don't know. I My guess is it was probably a um, supply chain issue. I feel like there's a lot of that happening. Uh, they did just bring back their hand soap, though. So maybe they will be bringing back um, some of their body care. Um, I loved it, though. It was a really good line. Uh, Berry Waffle Cone. Uh, Donna caught two lives. Yay! Party! <laughs> uh, beach Hut Marshmallow. Yes. Pumpkin. Yes, we need pumpkin cupcake back. I totally agree. Uh, do I do giveaways? I did. You know, I did last Christmas. Um, I don't mind doing giveaways. It just there's a lot of admin with giveaways. Um, but yes, I usually do more giveaways in the fall. Um, so keep an eye out for my channel. I do like doing them though. Uh, Halloween is in about two months. Dare we? I know, Peter. Yes, I know. <laughs> I know. I think what April thirtieth is like the six months to Halloween. <laughs> I know. Have you watched? No, I haven't watched Bridgerton yet. I am so bad. I need to start watching Bridgerton. I just have been so busy with everything. Um, it just has not been on my radar. But um, yeah, Ballet Nights needs to come back. Ballet Nights. Is that the one that's the same as Rose? Or is that the one that's the same? There's Ballet Nights is a dupe of something. Does anyone remember what that is for Patty? I know someone knows. It, it just slipped my mind. Um, what the heck is that, you guys? 
And Margarita Cupcake was really good, Haley. We definitely need a Margarita Cupcake back. Uh, I'm probably the only one who's super excited about Halloween and fall. Oh, no, no, there's a lot of us who are a little excited about Halloween and fall. <laughs> Ah, uh, thank you. Oh, Wicked Vanilla Woods. Yes, Latia. It was Wicked Vanilla. Belly Nights is Wicked Vanilla Woods, I think. Um, Sapphire Moon. Yeah, a lot of people like Sapphire Moon. Um, yes, I, I agree. I think it was. I did a side by side, and I think it was Wicked Vanilla Woods. Definitely, I know. So, what day is today? It's is today. Today's April seventeenth. I'm getting all confused here. I thought it was the fifteenth. It's the seventeenth. Candy potion. Oh, enchanted candy potion was amazing. Oh my gosh. So, um, do you recall the price point for the Miss body cream and body washes is semi annual? So, yes, GM. A lot of times, what they'll do is they'll do a fifty percent off price point. So, for example, seventeen ninety five, <coughs> it'll be fifty percent off. Sometimes they do 75% off. So the price point on that, let me get my calculator out. So if you got like a $17.95 product, you're going to pay like $4.48. Then like if they do a retro comeback collection, sometimes they'll do like a $3.95 or $4.95 price point. So that's kind of what you're looking at for semi-annual sale in like $3, 4 $5 range. So that's good. Um, oh, hey, Aletha. Ghoul friend. Yes, we need ghoul friend in the body care. Seriously. Uh, yes, this is my last video of today. I think I'm going to go relax. I'm going to watch some TV. I might watch a little House in the Prairie tonight. That's my relaxation video. <coughs> um, I resold all my everyday luxuries. Any ideas on how to store three wick candles? So, um, I like to keep mine in the crate because they're less likely to get uh, broken. And then I just stack the crate on those awesome wire racks from Sam's Club and I keep them in the basement. But that's kind of the best way for me to store them. Uh, I just love Little House. Uh, retro Golden Sunflower. Yeah, that could be. That's Greg's scent. That's a, that's a retro Greg scent. Um, yes, any of those would be really awesome to come back. So, Oh my gosh, almost eight o'clock. I'm so happy that you guys hung out with me and did a love it or lose it. Keep it or lose it. What did I call this video? It was something or lose it. It was <laughs> use it or lose it. That was it. Use it or lose it. I highly recommend you guys do that for um, your own collection. It's kind of fun. Grab a bin, do use it or lose it, and then you can give some stuff away. You can use it up. And then you're all happy because then you can buy new stuff. So anyway, oh my gosh, I'm so glad I did a live tonight. I made it. We did not lose power. Stay safe, everyone. Um, check out Dirty Soul Soap Company. Check out bonleo.com. And um, uh, I'll probably do another live maybe this weekend. We'll see. Uh, thank you so much, as always, for showing up to my lives. I always get amazed when people show up. We have a lot of fun, I think. I love this community so much. You guys are absolutely amazing. I will see you guys tomorrow. Have a great night. Bye-bye.